Yo, 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 it's Hendo, it's your favorite native the Average Savage, coming to you live from a bathroom. Vlogmas Day 4. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Help support a grassroots Indian. With that being said, let's get it. Good morning out there to all my fellow peeps. It is a beautiful morning. Man. What are you what are you slapping up for for the noon time snack? Ramen. What? Hey, if you guys don't know, this is the best ramen maker in the Pacific Northwest. She's been in in and out of the, the hoosk a couple times and perfected the craft. <laughs> what are we doing first, mother? Water for it. How, how much water are we putting in? Um, one and a half and one and a half. Per packet? Alright. Okay. Indian women don't like to go by instructions when it comes to cooking. Sometimes you just wing it. Your one pack of top ramen asks for two cups of water. Well, that ain't good enough, my mom says. She says one and a half does the biz. And so that's how she does it. One and a half cups of water. Makes it too watery. For one pack of ramen. And uh, she got uh, her water getting ready to start boiling up here. She's such a master grand chef. She can do it with two pots at the same time. So mother... Everyone wants to know, what was your occupation up there in the Hoosk? Uh, cook, painter, laundry shot, worker, shot caller, hey. <laughs> making cards, hair braider, tattooing, cheese. Tattooing. Yeah. Is that how you practice how to properly put in the right amount of seasoning? <laughs> Damn it, you dogs knock it off. I'm trying to do a video here. It's ready. Now it's going to take a minute. Ooh, see the master at work. She, she takes it out. Takes the packets out. As all regular people that know how to make ramen should. As soon as it starts getting pre boiled when it starts getting light bubbles in. She, ooh, game changer. She puts her seasoning packets in. Doa doa. She puts one in and then she throws. Whoa, game changer going on guys. She just put one seasoning packet in. Always put one season and get some. Huh. Oh. And all the flavor goes to the top ones. Oh, I see, I see. <laughs> so in order to make a uh some lump of noodles, you put in one packet of seasoning before so you can get what is it, mother? The, the flavor on the one's bottom. Flavored. Ah, okay. See that's a veteran move right there, ladies and gentlemen. Give her a round of applause. Oh, it's going. Oops. Look at that grandmaster. So, mother, what's the trick here when you got it all in? You just let it boil and just every now and then flip it? Boil, flip it around. Ah, I see. Pull it out. Feed nice babies. Dang, look at that goodness, guys. Ooh. It's like a spiritual orgasm. And this is when Chef Mastery comes into play. She's working her way over here and getting the other side going. Oh yeah, look at that. She's kept a good eye on it. She's took it off the burner now. I believe they are done. Oh, mother. Dang, look how 
too. Yeah. Chef mastery at its finest, guys. Uh -oh. And then you sit down and watch it get all nice and prepped and all succulents. What kind of other ingredients can you add with this if you're like super ghetto and just on a budget, mother? Soy sauce, hot sauce, peanut butter, soy sauce, Dang. peanut butter and hot sauce. <laughs> the whole shebang bang. Oh, no, no, no. I meant cheese and beans and tortillas. <laughs> <laughs> she knows it all. She's been in a couple times. She's got a couple new new uh, recipes here and there. But here we are, ladies and gents. Look how golden that is. Mm. Oh, yeah. They're very hot, so blow on it. Mmm, mmm. Excellent. I'm sorry, guys, I didn't share. But they're pretty sacred. So, but you motherfuckers know how to make them now, okay?